glaring empty spaces at Pretoria's only art museum. Missing are five of South Africa's most important works of art, taken right off the walls in the middle of the day. This is the first time that uh, criminal activity of this nature has occurred at any of the museums in South Africa, uh, where somebody would just walk in, take down a picture and, uh, and leave at a, at a museum. We've had similar cases in different other parts of the country where it would take place at a venue, uh, but not at an art museum. It's the first time this museum has been robbed since it opened in 1964, but security is a problem at many public galleries. The thieves came into the museum and pretended to be visitors. They even paid an entrance fee. They then held up a staff member at gunpoint and left with artwork worth $2 million. Police have recovered four of the missing pieces, but this painting, a street scene painted by South African artist Gerard Sekoto, is still missing. There are few clues about the suspects. The museum's video surveillance system wasn't working at the time of the theft. Museums all over the world are prime hunting grounds for art thieves as global syndicates tap into the lucrative market. The museum is closed for the week and removes some of the most valuable pieces until security can be increased and South Africa's treasures can be better protected. Haru Matasa, Al Jazeera, Pretoria.